Take you now to the Volta region because uh, the personnel at the Ghana Immigration Services Nivea Sector Command in the Volta region have intercepted 80 slabs of um, 80 parcels of uh, substances sus suspected to be uh, Indian. Um, uh, the alleged uh, M was uh, intercept intercepted at uh, Tikwi, uh, which borders Togo in the whole municipality uh, with the suspected um, content concealed in sacks, IV Setoji has the rest of the story. The Nive Sector Command of the Ghana Immigration Service has intercepted about 80 bags of suspected India hemp containing 80 parcels kept in a tipui in the whole municipal of the Voto region after a tip off. The Nive Sector Commander ACI Al Haji Abdullah is a career in an interview with Joy News narrated where the parcels of India hemp were kept. We acted based on intel. We had an intel that uh, the, the goose uh, suspected to be India hemp were lodged at a particular place at Atike near the clinic. So we quickly mobilized our men, did it with a, a Ghana Revenue Authority, that is Customs Division, and deployed them to the area. We got there, secured the grounds, and went searching and actually got the goods that were kept in two separate rooms. So what we did was to immediately convey the goods to the border post for safekeeping. And that is what we have actually done. ACI Al Haji Abdullah Zakaria called for collaboration between the public and immigration in order to clamp down the menace. Collaboration. We need their collaboration. This is a national security issue. Uh, drug peddling is a serious crime, and we need collaboration of the citizen so that we'll be able to arrest the perpetrators of this crime. And so we would like to plead with them when they get their information they should be ready to share it with us and this could save our society our children the acting voto regional commander assistant commissioner of immigration aci noah ahumka yeboa who also used the opportunity to tour other sectors of immigration in the region commended the men at Nive for the good job done over the past years and urged them to do more. Well, what I would say is that the men have done a human's job. And this area or this sector, the Nive sector, which goes through Shiatikwi and the Ujukope and others, right? they have consistently performed in terms of intersections. If you look at their records from 2021, there have been series of intersections involving narcotics, but this is the, the largest of it all because we have had 200 and 2,000 plus slabs. This one, given the estimates that in each slab we are going to have roughly about 80, about 80 times 80, that's 64,000. We are looking at give and take 64,000. That's huge. And if this is what is happening in the community, we can only say you, I mean, we can only encourage our officers to do more. The communication from the CD is to tell them that he appreciates what they are doing and they should keep doing it and that they will extend every support that there is for them to do the work that they are charged to do. So the suspects are on the run and the command is still investigating the issue to bring the suspects to book. Mm -hmm. Joy News, Nive.